Welcome back, UFC fans. For Saturday, UFC 273, we saw the long-awaited welterweight matchup between rising superstar Hamza Chimaev and the number two ranked guy in the division, Gilbert Burns. Burns is a four-time world champion in jiu-jitsu, and Chimaev, who's ranked number 11th in the world in uh, the UFC in the welterweight class, had a hard time, but he won the fight. This just tells you how good Hamzad is, and it's not just all hype, he's the real thing. Now, I think next, uh, Dana White was saying he's probably going to fight Colby Covington, which I think he's going to breeze right through. And then the big showdown will be Hamzad against Usman. And how's that going to go down? Well, I think Hamzad proved last night that he's a worthy opponent for anybody, but he does need these fights at a very high level in order to get ex experience. Up until this point, he had never been challenged, and Burns certainly gave him a good opposition. So before facing Usman, who's an absolute killer at the welterweight division, uh, I think it, it'll be good for him that he has this fight under his belt and that he faces Covington next because he's got to learn to pace himself. That was Hamzat's main uh, shortcoming in this fight. He was going for the knockout, the knockout from the, round, the, the, the first bell as soon as the first round started, and he admitted so after the fight in the post-fight interview. So Shimaya versus Covington next. Like I said, Shimaya's going to breeze through him. And then he fates his uh, Kamar Usman. Well, Usman, I think, might have met his match. It's too early to tell. And Usman is a great champion. So I don't want to say, uh, you know, that he's going to necessarily lose to Shimaev. But this boy is the real deal. He's big. He's strong. He's, I mean, I mean, Burns is a phenomenal jiu-jitsu guy. He could never take him down. He just, his legs were like cement stuck in the ground. Unbelievable how tough Shimaev is. the real thing. So like, subscribe, comment, tell me what you think. And is this guy the future welterweight king or will Usman remain champion for a longer period of time? Tell me what you think. Love to hear from you.